Shalom, shalom. Man, did you know that only 36 states require voter ID? That means when you go to the voting poll, the rest of these states are not checking IDs. Let's talk about it. Praise to the Most High Yah Shalom. Thank you for tuning in to another Righteous Spiritful episode. Today I'm back at an in them trenches handling that kingdom business. Man, I'm going to play a little bit of a clip right here just to let you know uh, what we're dealing with right here. And I often tell you guys the game is rigged. Um, and they, they, California just passed, which is shocking. It's hard to believe this is even, this is even real. But California just passed a law making it illegal. Uh, to require voter ID in any election at all in California. Do you, you know that? No. Yeah, Newsom signed it into law last week. It's illegal to require an ID. In any election, even a town council. And, and a friend of mine who, was, who, thought, this, can the, who lives in Palo Alto was like, is, it was like, is this actually r real? And he went to like vote in like some city council election. He tried to show them his ID and they said, we're not even allowed to look at your ID. See, most people take the mainstream route of doing what everybody else is doing, doing what you are told you have to do, and counting on these people to make the move for you. See, I know that the Most High Yah has it to where you can make your own moves. He encourages you to make your own moves. He encourages you to live set apart. Now I want you to think about these open borders that happened within the last year. There are some states that these people are going to flood to and most of the benefits that they're gonna receive are gonna come from states that don't require voter ID. California, the state that so many people love. California is one of the states that just passed a law where they no longer require voter ID. What does that mean? When you show up to the voting poll, if you pull out an ID, these people are almost gonna have an allergic reaction to looking at your ID because it's now illegal. So you can show up multiple times and cast ballot. Nobody doesn't care if you are a citizen. Nobody doesn't care about your status, whether you're naturalized or what, what, what. Nobody cares in these states that don't uh, check voter ID. I told you, man, see, you can waste a lot of your life trying to play the game straight up while they're doing nothing but giving you bread and circus, nothing but stage play. You know, they're sitting back lining their pockets, getting rich, while you sit back and play their little games. It's kind of like what adults do when you got uh, adults coming over to your house and you got some kids. Y'all go in there and play the game. Talking about grown-up stuff. They don't, even th they, they don't even think you deserve a seat at the table. You know, if you're taking this stuff serious, and you're with one of these states where my state is playing it honest. What about the other players? These other players got a cheat code for you. And you think about how many states we have in total versus only 36. And here's the thing. This is not stuff that is broadcasted mainstream. They don't broadcast this because it's bad for business. Therefore, on platforms like this, I have to show you what's really going on behind the scenes. What's really going on. You know, you have these people that are die hard left or die hard right, die hard liberal, die hard conservative, die hard right or left wing, you know, that would 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 cause all kind of chaos if this was publicized on the news. 
but it is paid programming. It is tell a vision. I just want you to realize you are waiting on these people to save you. I'm telling you what, and I, I, I've said it in another video. All they're doing is, is lining their pockets right now, borrowing money from other countries, and that debt is gonna be on your grandkids, your kids. That's who the debt's gonna be on. But they're making money off of borrowed money while you sit up and try to play the game straight up. And the destination is the same place. It's destruction. Biblically, it's the same place. Are you gonna be a part of the set apart or are you gonna be a part of the common? Closer to y'all ministries, kicking a gun barrel straight. Wow.